if you have the ultimate evidence-based plan from, geez, Renaissance periodization itself, and you've downloaded the RP hypertrophy app, uh, discount code in bio, I don't know, as that's what influencers say. But, um, but you do it intermittently, you do it on and off stuff. You, you ever had conversations with people, you're like in, uh, in the metro, let's say in London, where you're from, I believe. All English people are from London, yes, <laughs> of course. And, um, you know, they're asking you tips because they saw that you're jacked and you start giving them tips and you eventually get in a conversation of like, well, so like how many times a week do you lift? And they'd be like, well, you know, it's five. You're like, mm -hmm, yes, yes. I see where this is going. They're like, but like lately, you know, my dog's been real sick. So my wife left me. An interesting sounding London and hand. Yeah, right. So bro talk is actually universal. It's just one accent everywhere. Right. You could be British English and then the lifting starts and you're like, yeah, man, <laughs> luck and curls like Arnold did it. And you're like, Arnold, that's it. Drop that meme. So yeah, you know, consistency is a big deal, but it's not the only deal. Uh, if you do something consistently, my thought on that is you might as well do it pretty well. You don't have to go all crazy sciencey like we're going to get into in the next, you know, whatever, half hour, however long it takes you to get pissed and kick me off. But, um, but when you are consistent, it multiplies the emphasis that you should be doing whatever it is you're doing quite well, because with you is, you're committing a lot of time to it, a uh, bit of a sunk cost there, might as well optimize on the margins. And then we can talk a lot about all the details.